I am so honored to be here tonight and grateful to be the recipient of this award. It's a big day for me. He, <clears throat> it's been a long and hard journey of 62 years. There, are, there were ample difficulties and obstacles on the way, but something in me made me push through it all. The journey of Azra's poultry equipment started way back in 1956 by my late father, Mr. Bashir Ahmad. He was an ardent lover of livestock and had a small backyard farm. Back then, there was a lack of poultry equipment manufacturers, and so he designed his own brooders and other equipment. What started as a hobby <coughs> developed into a business that has been stood the test of time, driven by a passion that still remains. When I joined the business, I was just 16 years old. I started pushing the boundaries. Let me share with you what the poultry industry was like back then, so that you have a sense <coughs> of what a great place we are in today. It was a very difficult time till 1973 and a 1,000 bird layer farm was considered a big one. The major problems the farmers used <coughs> using deep litter faced was disease like coccidiosis and etc. It was during these years that a chance meeting with the American Peace Corps, I came to know of the cage system used in, used in California. I developed this system by just looking at pictures. Thus started the journey of cages and the introduction to, of the poultry cage system in India. The first batch of cages for 500 birds was supplied to a farmer by the name of Mr. Burby at Whitefield, Bangalore. I got my first large order in 1974 for 4,000 layer cage, cages from Mr. Harban Singh of Hyderabad. That was a large size poultry farm then. Today an average farm is 5 lakh birds and above. I am proud to say that Azra's poultry equipment are the only ones who have survived the various economic cycles. While we have seen our competitors shut down, we have not only been able to sustain but also grow despite the hardships of time. Only because of our quality, our dedication to R&D and the commitment to the industry. Our international partners have also helped fuel further growth. In my career of 62 years, it has been a journey of ups and downs, exhilarations and frustrations, but a journey of experience, growth and self-satisfaction. And today I am thankful to the organizers of Poultry India for bestowing upon me this felicitation in recognition of my untiring efforts. To take a few names who have been my support and helpful to me in my journey. My late friend Mr. B.V. Rao, Mr. Jagpati Rao, Mr. Lakshmiya Punalla, my late friend Mr. Madan Mohan, Mr. R.K. Soni, Sheshaya, Radha Krishnaya, Soma Raju, Upal Raju, Guru Raja Farmer from Mysore, Manikam of Mega Farms in Mysore, and of course, Nandu Kumar, who is here with us today. Last but not least, my dear friend and colleague, Mr. Chakradhar Rao. It would not be complete without my constant supporters, my family and my staff who still stand by my side till today. If there is one thing we all take away from this today is that we are a great, we are in a, at a great moment in the poultry industry. <coughs> Befriend your competitors, they are also your colleagues. Knowledge is always better when it is shared. I reflect on my journey today I thank my younger self for focusing on the goals and not the hurdles 
by believing in myself when no one else did. For being there no matter how tough the going got. I dedicate this award to all my clients across the country as well as internationally. I would not be standing here today without you all. And it is because of your collective effort that the industry will continue to shine and grow to new heights. Thanks once again to Poultry India. Thank you.